This philosophy has been around for a ridiculously long time. Our understanding of how to work with large systems is based on a very simple concept of bandwidth. The bandwidth limitation, am I talking about network bandwidth? No. The bandwidth limitation is this. It turns out that while something like building architecture has a natural scale, the natural scale of building architecture is the human being. If you look at any building, it doesn't matter if it's a skyscraper or a garden shed, it's based on the scale of a human being. If you look at a building that is supposed to be impressive, the reason it's impressive is because you are a human being. Okay. Uh, I went to uh, Cologne a few years ago, and the cathedral in Cologne, I've always been told, is very impressive. You come out of the main station, you go, wow, that's a really big piece of Gothic architecture. And it's big, but if you are a giant 400 meters tall, it's not very impressive. Okay. The whole point is that it's designed for the human scale. It's designed to impress the humans at that scale. That's what it's for. So all architecture is grounded in a natural physical limit. Software is not. What is the natural scale of software? Well, it doesn't really have a hard limit, but I'll tell you what the natural limit of effective and sustainable software is. It's software you can fit in your head. Not the whole of it, but you can break it down into pieces that you can load into your head. If I can understand a function, a class, or whatever easily, then I will work quickly and confidently with it. It may be connected to a larger system, but if it is loosely coupled, I can reason about these things at distance. So normally people try and motivate coupling through very abstract computer science. Forget it, you can motivate it through psychology. Okay? The human brain gives us a natural limit. We are not very good at holding lots and lots of stuff at once and not dropping something. It's not that you can't work on something that is large and complex and highly interconnected and very legacy. It's the fact that you will slow down and you are more likely to make errors.